What's up everyone, this is Will from Disney Infinity TV, coming at you straight from E3, well the aftermath of E3. Thought I would give you a little bit of a first look of some of the uh, new Marvel superhero characters. Uh, so first up I'm going to show you Venom, the chaser character. So here he is, uh, awesome, awesome character. So I did want to say one thing that I think might some people might be confused about. He was a chaser character only at the event, I don't think he's going to be rare uh, post this E3 event. I they were just giving away uh, these characters as not as often as the other Marvel Marvel characters like Cap or uh, Nick Fury you see behind me over there. So the character is really awesome. Um, you can actually kind of tell this figure is one that uh, is, is probably not the manufacturing. It looks like there's glue marks on it. I don't know if you can see that, but there's some of the edges there where it's a little shinier than the rest of it. And it looks like maybe fingerprints and uh, glue marks from when the character was being created. But that's cool. It kind of adds something to it. Uh, I did want to compare the size of this guy to some of the uh, some of the other larger characters that we have. So up here I have... Crystal Sully, and so if we put these two side by side, you can see their similar form factor. Um, it does look like Venom is uh, slightly larger though, at least uh, in weight, he's a lot heavier. So I think where he kind of has the bulk over uh, Sully is in his uh, torso area. So still pretty big. Let me go grab Racket Ralph here. Okay, so the, uh, the stature for Ralph I actually think these characters are a little bit more similar in size and weight, even though their dimensions are slightly different. Uh, if you listen to our exclusive interview with JV, then uh, he actually tells you a little bit about how this character, the Venom character, came about. Originally, he, his body and his size was uh, a slightly bulkier version of Spider-Man, but uh, when they were actually developing this character, they decided to put uh, Venom's head on... Um, uh, on Hulk's uh, frame and the, the back end development side, kind of his skeletal frame and the size and mass of it just fit and they instantly said that's how they determined the look and size of this figure. So you can see he's really kind of crazy and almost scary looking. I love Venom. Uh, in fact, I, I wasn't initially that thrilled with this character, but um, turns out he he's probably the favorite character I have so far. So it's just really cool. He looks mean looking. Uh, the paint on him also seems like it might be uh, hand painted, which also might lend to the idea of it being a, a rare figure right right now. So that's it. So uh, yeah, you can see you can uh, you can see he's a he's a cool figure. I dig him. Um, size, bulk, strength. He's going to be a lot of fun to play. I did uh, play around a little bit with him at E3. He he has similar powers to uh, Spider-Man. He's, he's swinging and it's a lot of fun to play with. So I'm really excited about this character. Uh, make sure you check out our other uh, character quick looks and uh, make sure you check out our YouTube channel, Disney Infinity TV. It's youtube.com forward slash Disney Infinity TV. You can also find us at DisneyInfinity.tv and uh, look for us on iTunes or Stitcher Radio if you want to uh, subscribe to our podcast at Disney Infinity TV. All right, thanks. We'll talk to you soon.